What is up guys, this is Yuki Chip and Brian here, we're playing our episode of Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Geek to Infinity. So, on our last adventure, we did stuff, I don't remember, it's been a while since we played this game anyway. From our last encounter to this one, you could see a little difference, the total, uh, total adventures we increased as well as our level. And that is during that time that we stopped recording between our last episode to this episode. Um, I just did, I just increased my level, went to a few dungeons and stuff. The story so far, Umbreon said he was separated from Espeon when a known sailor attacked them both. You and the team headed to Craig's of Lament to save Espeon and Dan. And that's what we're actually going to do. So I'm actually at level um, 17. Accu's at level 17 as well. Dunsport is at level 18. And Emo, Lo em Emo Loga is at 19. So we are all good to go. Um, we raised our rank to gold. Like about four, four hours ago. And then I raised it to um, platinum. I'm not sure if there's anything more after platinum or not, but oh um, well. Where will we go? Yep. We are actually going to Craig's of, of Limit right now. Oops, uh, give me a second, sorry. This is just the three of us, oh well. You can't escape us no matter how quick you scamper. Where? Where are you? Crawl ka ka ka. Wouldn't you like to know? Why won't you come and find us? Um, I'm the one running away from you here. Why would I come after you? I'm trying to get away. Right? And you'll never catch me. Not, not fools like you. Besides, I know what you're after and I will never hand them over to you. Nah, <laughs> what a troublesome girl. Crawl, ka, ka, ka. But she's looking pretty tired, ain't she? It's only a matter of time before we nab her. Crawl, but we better finish it. this up fast, though. Or we'll be one game run. Rack next. Crawl, ka, ka, ka. I know, Crawl. Three times over that. And so is Espeon's Freedom, Crawl. It's a little cutscene, looks like.
level 20. HP went up by 2, attack went up by 2, defense went up by 1, special attack went up by 2, special defense went up by 1. Let's go, you let's go and save it as beyond. We come pre probably we're still I haven't seen any sign of Espeon, huh? Maybe she's still somewhere up ahead. Let's hurry. Yuki. Alright, right now we are gonna this deposit.
Electro Mountain. Friends and Cut Corners. Special. I know you might be thinking, why did I do that instead of doing something else? My HP went up by one, by two. My attack went up by two. My defense went up by one. My special attack went up by two. My special defense went up by one. Going over there. We're going to avoid it if we can, which we did. This running and dodging is really wearing me out. But it looks like we got you perfectly cornered now. Good. Rock. <laughs> hey, Perugly. At least you got the easy part. I'm the one who had to run ahead and cut her off, Croak. I'm super tired, Croak. Oh dear, Toxic Croak. Perhaps a sign you need to. You need more exercise, hmm? Krokaka, you're the one who's talking. I saw you huffing and puffing back there. Krokaha, now hand them over. Give us everything you got. Nehaha, <laughs> she's gonna listen to you. Hope you pass it just to take them by force. Ah, uh, scratch, uh, perfectly scratch through Espion's belongings. Nehaha. <laughs> What's up? This girl doesn't. She doesn't have anything on her. What? Hey, how do you stash them? Where do you... Where's the enter cards? If you don't tell us, we have to force it out of you. I hope you're prepared to be on. Stop! Now! That's what it looks like. Must be Espeon. Haha, <laughs> alright. We made it. Yeah. What's this? And who are you, strangers? Where's that Goku? We're here to save Espeon. What are you fools talking about? I don't get it, Croak. Girl, you're so irritating. I just want to get this job over with. Croak, I guess we have to take care of them then. Let's get this. Let's get this over quick. Quick. You're right. Look at our. Looks like it's our only choice. Here they come, Evie. I don't know who you are. Who you are, fools. I don't know who you fools are, but you pick up the wrong party to crash. Let's go.
Kuroka Kakaka. Yeah, nee, nee, ha, ha, ha. There. Ah, uh, scram. Hey, are you okay? Did you get, did they get you? We're here to help you. Umbreon told us everything. I see Umbreon, he. Thank you for saving me. I'm probably seeing better days, but I'm, I'll be fine. No, I am fine. Pokemon like that can't get the better of me. You got some guts, at least, that's for sure. I'm glad to hear it. More importantly, though, I must hurry to post town. There's something I have to be sure of. Got it, let's go then. Umbreon's waiting for us, too. Espeon, Umbreon, Snibble, I'm so glad you are right. I didn't know I was worried about you, but as much as I want to enjoy this moment with you, there's something I have to. I know Espeon, but we got to at least thank Yuki and the other viewers properly first. Of course. Yuki asks you, everyone, I owe you all so much. You save us. Neither of us would be here without you. No problem. We're just glad you're both okay. But the Pokemon who attacked you too, who could they be? Who knows? I got no idea who they were, but Umbreon, they really were after the enter cards. So they were, that was my guess. I didn't know who the Pokemon that attacked us were. They were after the enter cards and they were Go seem obvious enough. If they want us to get in the way, they must have got, want to get in the way of our research, or they plan to steal the enter cards because they want to go to the Great Glacier themselves. What? What? Hey, wait up! You just said no. They just said something missing, like it w was nothing, right? Huh? Did I really? I just. I just said they might be after that intercourse to get to the Great Glacier. The Great Glacier? You can say you can actually go to the Great Glacier. But that mighty distant glacier that Nate Pokemon has a year of reach. You, you say? You say you could go there. Give me a second. You say you could go up there? Uh, right. I guess I didn't, I haven't mentioned any of this yet, have I? The two of us have this, has decided our careers to study Great Glacier. Deep within the Great Glacier, that's where it must be. The great crystal that caused all matter surrounding it to flow in the air. That is what Abreon believes. The great crystal that makes matter float. There's no way to prove it, it exists except by going to, into the Great Glacier itself. But in front of the Great Glacier is a huge crevasse, crevasse, crevasse or crevasse that prevents anybody from reaching it. That's why I thought of using the, uh, using le ley lines. I want them to create a dungeon that would lead beyond the cre crevasse or crevasse. The dungeon could get us right up to the base of the Great Glacier. We can make the enter cards, we will create such a dungeon. We should be able to reach the Great Glacier, at least we think so. That's amazing, that's what it means to build if you just set the enter cards together. You can, you can actually reach the Great Glacier. Pretty much. Though we still need to make a few more adjustments. But it might be late for that now. Espeon, from the looks of things, we don't have your enter cards anymore, do you? Did those crews steal from you? It's fine, it doesn't matter if they did. I don't even care about losing the enter cards if you... As long as you are safe in here with me again. Then I... Honestly, Aubreon, could you not leap into your own conclusion without giving me a chance to explain? The enter cards weren't stolen. 
what happened. But instead, what well, I almost could have probably have been. The truth is that I done something I truly regret on Bria. Oh, you're here. Are you alright? You didn't get hurt. Please tell me you're okay. Yes, madam, I am fine. And these are sweat, sweat loon handed us beyond the enter cards. Those are the enter cards, but why did I soon have them? I kept my promise, madam. I didn't tell anybody, not anybody. Yes, I see that. Thank you, little one. You must be, you must have been so scared. Now I can get scared over that. I'm really strong. I'm so glad. Please forgive me. When okay, she's crying. I'm really okay, man. I'm honest. Oh, please don't cry. What in the world is going on? I really can't imagine. Miss Espion, it's nice to meet you. I am this boy's mother. Oh, I'm so sorry. What did I was unforgivable because of my actions your son? The sweet child was put in danger. In danger if you didn't mind. Could you please explain what happened to my son? Of course. Ever since I lost the sight of ever since I lost sight of Umbreon, I've been in a run for our pursuers. I tried to make it to make it to post town, but my enemies were always one step ahead. I've been so close to post town for so long, but never made it safely. I buried my precious belongings so they wouldn't fall into the wrong hands. But I couldn't stop worrying, so I went back to the hiding spot in in Flora Forest. Uh huh. I made it to a spot where I buried my things. Every moment I felt like my enemy might only be a few steps behind me. Ha, huh. ha. Huh. But when I reached my hiding spot. This young boy was there. You, what do you think you're doing? Ah, uh, sorry. The enter cards. This child m had the, uh, my precious belongings. They were there in the dirt, including the enter cards. Oh, ah, uh, does this all belong to you, madam? I'm really sorry. I wouldn't have disturbed them if I knew they belonged to someone. I was rattled. If my person had found this child, the enter cards would have been lost forever. More importantly, though, if they had followed me into the forest, I might still be attacked at that at any moment. What to do? I searched desperately for an answer, and that's when I made a mistake. Haha, <laughs> child, you must listen carefully to what I'm about to say. Okay. No, not like this. If I look desperate, he might. He might, he's just be frightened. I have to be calm. Ready. Listen, it's true that these things belong to me, but there's something here you want in particular. Yeah, I thought this red stone was really pretty. Is that right? Then, I give you this stone. What? Really? It's yours, but first I need you to make me a promise. Why don't you take those cards with you as well? Oh, these cards? That's right. I want you to take to keep them until I come back. Until I come, until I come to get them back from you. And these cards will be our little secret, right? Just yours and mine. I don't want to tell anyone else about these cards. What do you think? Can you promise me that? Yeah, I will. I promise. I won't tell anybody about your cards, madam. I live in Post Town. Come visit soon, okay? I will. Resto, resto, resto. That noise is someone coming. Okay, then I got to be going, but going to straight home, right? Your mother will be worried about you. I'll be home. I'll be heading home now. See you later. Woohoo, I got the red jewel. And that's how I ended up entrusting the entry cards to this child. But afterwards, I realized I've done my folly. Despite any promises, our secret might have not remained a secret for long. By placing the entry cards, enter cards in this child's care, the Pokemon's per persuading, pursuing us somehow, learning he had the cards. 
It's also true that our Wii spot really could have been one tape A. As soon as I reached like that, I hurried back to intro reports at once, but I was but I was too late. The spot loot was gone. We must have passed one another. We probably head back into the forest right after we'd gone to refresh the spot loot. It must have been desperate, but think about the ditch I put that, and it's a boy and I. But I couldn't run every moment after that. I had the chance to look for him. The whole time I was running, I was possibly sick with worry. Thank goodness. Oh, thank goodness. Nothing happened. Please don't cry, Miss Espion. Listen to my mom, madam. Please don't cry. You were, you were so afraid that you acted on that fear. You felt like no, no other choice. I'm going to give myself a glass. Um, you even had that being haunted. You kept myself in my heart. Thank you. And more importantly, my wife, Loon, kept his promise to you. That makes me proud. He's str- he is surely strong, strong for having shared this secret with you and being true to his word. A- as a mother, I'm grateful for you that gave Miss Espion. Wow. That's great, huh? Espion. Espion. Yes, everything worked out. That's one mystery solved at least, um, Umbreon. What are you two planning to do now? Yeah, about that, if it's not too much trouble, would it be alright if we stay here a bit longer? There's a good chance we'll be targeted he- again as soon as we leave Post Town and neither of us is in the best shape right now. Then suppose that's probably for the best. Of course, you can't, you can't stay. We aren't expecting any other guests, so you, you kept your rooms as long as you need them. Thanks, Juana. We'll definitely take you up on that. Everyone should get used to us seeing us a regular picture in the inn for a while. You still have to pay the bills, of course. I knew that. Today was definitely eventful, but at least SBM wasn't hurt, right? When, per- when we first met Espion, I thought she was tough, but she was to take things seriously and tries really hard. Or thinks really hard, I don't know. And I never thought she would just burst into tears like that. Umbreon really single-minded too. I like him. I really like both of them. It's true. It's obvious that even how Espion, how serious Espion and Umbreon are about their research and... What about the entry cards they study, and what the magnate created by those cards? At that moment, when the circle of light floated the hill, the side of the magnate appeared in the middle of the blinding light. That's something I'll never forget, and I'll be said that in an incomplete version of what it will be like if it was completed. It's kind of I kind of want to see that. Yeah, I know what you mean. Hey, Yuki, I've been thinking. I would like you to help um, Espion Umbreon with the research. What do you think? Would it be a bad idea for the for the group to help out with it? I think it would be great. Yeah, I'm glad it's not just me. Thanks, Yuki. So we'll talk to Umbreon about it tomorrow. Okay? I guess it's out of call it a night tomorrow then night Yuki. The next morning. will rest in a couple minutes, like in five minutes. Just want to see what happens. UK, I know we talked about it last night, but let's go and talk to Umbreon. It's been first thing in the morning. I want to tell them we're here and to help however we can. I think they should sit still be at, at Swana's place. Let's go, UK. Alright, um, before we do that, we have no money, okay. Oh, everyone left.
Okay, so in order for Gerdner and his group to build more faculties, um, they need at least two, like, buildings and stuff, so... You want to build faculty here? What faculty do you want to build? So we did the berries and seeds already, and the oldies of her, of orbs, I mean. We have elite boutique, swap shop, Prize place, detour guide, baritic slide, sunken treasure. I think prize place is what we'll try right now. You two slackers, yes, boss. Would you look at that? It's done. We have built your pri prize palace for you. I once had Miss Gruder help Mr. Gruder help me with a bit of a business, so I'm glad to hear he has returned to work and building again. I will have to do my best as well. Well, we'll build some faculties that it looks like we're gonna run out of space. We'll prepare some land. All right. I feel like I could do some real preparing now. And in order for him to have done land, he needed three faculties. We already did two, and two of them off screen. And then the one we just did is the one that we did on screen. And my clearing skill will be gone up. I think I come up with something new. Yeah, that's right. I come prepare land to be cool creekside now. Want to try? Well, then you want to prepare some land. Just get the materials and stop by. Oh, and my skills has come for. Carpenter has been better. Now we'll be able to re e trophet the focuses we have built already. Even upgrade them to something better. Think about it. Call me if you need anything else. Real quick before we uh, be done with this episode, we're just going to build one place. You want to prepare the land and the girder crew all you need. You want to prepare some land? Alright, because if you look at the map on the bottom, we only have nothing on these, so at least something else. So give me a break, just forget about prepare. Now add it to Cool Creekside then. Got to prepare it to be Cool Creekside. The land was prepared to be a Cool Creekside. Alright, so I'll prepare to go check it out when you got a sec. You need something else? No, huh? Okay, come again sometime. Uh, we're actually going to see it real quick, then we'll be done with this episode. So let's see. Whoa. It, like, totally change. This place is really comfortable. Oh, nothing. Let's create an amazing paradise. Are you serious? E, how are you? Oh, I walk across the water. Okay. 
somehow, somehow I walked across water. Alright guys, so this is all for today's episode. Don't forget to like and subscribe to your friends all about my channel. Don't forget to comment on the videos and as always I'll see you guys next time for another episode of Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Gates to Infinity. Alright, have a nice day.